Here we are in the fourth quarter now. This is part three, I believe. Hopefully it doesn't take this doesn't take this long. So I can get the draft or get the interviews and stuff. There goes Kelly Anderson down the stairs. Here's Blaze Anthony. I'm gonna pass it because it can with the kind of shot we got. We'll change it though, Blaze. We'll change it. There's that bucket. Down by eight. Not bad. Wonder if I win more games with Blaze Anthony than I did with Anderson in the first season. That I had. I mean, had earlier telephones going off. For some reason, guys, part one of the rookie showcase isn't uploading right now. Hopefully, it does. But it wasn't working for some reason. I think there might be. I think I might know why. Here we are with the ball. We're gonna hand it off to Beal. Episode one of the creation work. It's up. It uploaded. Now I just gotta get it to YouTube, which I will do when we are done here in the draft and all that. Once we get a home for Blaze Anthony. I'm going to just type all his information in my phone though. So that I, when I change it back to my Anderson guy. Yeah, it won't be that weird. My Anderson dude might look different. I didn't write down my, my head number and all that. So I might might look a bit different. That'll be okay though. I don't know what that guy was doing. Why haven't we got subbed out yet? Here's Ellis. Hopefully he misses. Here's Barnes. Look at him going down. I call for the pass. Look at that. There's a bucket for us. I can't believe we're not subbed out yet. They really want Blaze Anthony to go to a good team, maybe. Blaze got the three. We only hit one in this game. Hope this doesn't affect my Connor Anderson stuff. Cause I shoot amazing threes and now I, if, I, if it goes to this stuff I will miss a lot. And that will hurt our team. Here's Blaze Anthony. We missed the open shot. And that's a minus of VC. So. Oh my gosh. Three minutes left. Fourth quarter. Sullinger just got rocked out there. Got blocked. I'm calling for it. Because I got a three point shot right here. Nope. They don't want to give it to me.
part three almost done here. Calling for the ball. I actually didn't call for it, he just passed it and I missed the open shot that I had down low. I had a little bit of room to lay it in, I missed. There goes Davis. Oh, that's a bad pass selection. Good. I had to pass it in, so. Here's Barnes. Finds Anthony. No. Look how close that was, Blaze. Hopefully you watch these. They're on Facebook, and now I'm putting these on YouTube, too, I guess. So people who aren't on my Facebook can still see this. Showcase when I played either in Anderson. So, what else? There's Jackson Ellis. He will be tough to watch for the final minutes. Sorry, my, head, my headphones are coming out. My headset, my speaker, my mic. And there goes Jackson Ellis. <coughs> He's got 36. He's definitely going to get drafted before me for sure. Oh, and he's out of bounds. It was so close, though. And this will be the end of the Ricky Showcase 99-84. We lose, but that's okay. That's okay if Carmelo, or I keep saying Carmelo, with Blaze Anthony. I think that's okay for us. This video will end in about six minutes, maybe less. See how much BC we got? 211. For Blaze Athens.
about four minutes left in the video. And we know what we're gonna answer for to hear. Make sure we always on the same page when it comes to goals and expectations. Alright. Alright, let's start with the win. If you had your choice to play for any NBA team, who would it be? And this is why, Blaze, I asked you this question on Facebook because I didn't know I didn't know what team to, that you would like. You said Toronto. So we're gonna pick Toronto. Yeah, that's the one, baby. You know it. <laughs> I figured you might say that, but you know, as your agent, I can't be assuming stuff. This will help me though when I'm behind the scenes working on stuff. Okay, okay, so, what is the one thing that's most important to you in your NBA career? Uh, probably to be a great teammate. Yeah, man, what's up, we done? I think you'd be a nice yeah, teammate. Yeah, we're done. I lined up a few interviews with some teams that were really showing interest in you, alright? So before they talk to you in person, I want to get a feel of what your personality is like. So that's, that's this video is over in two minutes. Alright, so let's take care of that and then we can head out. I think I'll add it here and then I'll have another separate video for the interviews. Okay, right after this we'll end the video. Do you feel like the ball should be in your hand? Match up the game? Yes. Do you feel it is your responsibility to continue playing at a high level? Yes. Which of the following is more important? Defense. Players all the plays and I would say yes to this. We'll be talking with the team that I'm on in my Anderson. Hello, and nice to meet you. First before I end the video. For the We're looking if to they talk quick enough. YouTube. I think you might be that guy. I'd like to ask you a couple questions to make sure. Here we go. As a younger team, I feel like we have a lot of opportunity for you. I'm here to tell you that you have a chance to be our franchise centerpiece if you put in the work. How many other teams can offer you that? That being said, we still have a couple years ahead of us where we're going to be acquiring young talent and assets. We might struggle a bit in those years. Are you going to be able to remain focused during the rebuilding years? I've never really lost in my entire life. I've always been good enough to tell every team I've ever been on to success. I realize the NBA is different in that regard, at least at the start of my career. This is really my time. But as a man, I'm up for the challenge. You guys might miss a little bit of this interview. One more question. Because we only got 30 seconds left. We'll and a 15 minute timer. Recording. Just ignore the. Ignore the thing. Back you. Yeah, video one time.